welcome. Thank you so much for watching. This show's all about giving you insights and showcasing brands that help you to live your best life and give you confidence. As always, I want to kickstart your morning with some motivational advice to help you to feel inspired and energized to start your day. Today, I want to talk about why jealousy is rooted in unfulfillment. We all have a point in our lives where we feel envious of someone. This can go back to our elementary school days or when we were envious of that popular kid in high school. As we get older, we may feel jealous of those who have more money or fame than us. To each person, the reason for jealousy differs. But at its root, why do we really feel jealous? The truth is, jealousy is rooted in unfulfillment. When we don't feel whole and complete, we look at external things and we compare ourselves to others. We think, why am I not rich? Why don't I have the perfect job or relationship? The reasons are endless. If you ever find yourself jealous of what someone else has, remind yourself that it's because of feeling unfulfilled, and that you can change that feeling at any moment by making the decision to go after that very thing you seek. Jealous of someone having their dream job? Start applying for jobs and start cold calling companies. Stress out because you don't have enough money? Work twice as hard as someone else and find innovative ways to make money. Jealous of someone having their dream partner? Put yourself out there and work on improving yourself both mentally and physically to attract your dream partner. Anything you truly seek is seeking you. As Dennis Whaley quotes, it is not in the pursuit of happiness that we find fulfillment. It is in the happiness of the pursuit. Stay tuned, coming up after the break. You were told that you only have a thousand days to live based on your health condition. So walk us through that experience and you know, that aha moment. You know, that was a really interesting, we'll call it a trip, a journey, mm. because today I'm 63 years old and I've got about 20,000 days left to live based upon the trajectory and what we've learned. When I was 46 years old, I hit the wall with three different major health problems between heart disease, what was diagnosed as uh, colon cancer, which that's disputable, and liver cancer. Wardrobe provided by H&M. Next up on the show, we have Ian Clark, the CEO and founder of Activation Products. Activation Products' brand mission is to naturally improve the quality of life for people around the world by creating products that help you to live your best life. Ian, thank you so much for being on the show today. How are you doing? I'm doing fantastic and very happy to be here with you. We're so glad to have you. I was just saying I love your background. It's very, very catchy, but it's a pleasure to have you on the show. So I want to talk to you a little bit about your products. Um, when I first got introduced to your brand, I watched your intro video and it really caught my attention and resonated with me. And you quoted that everything in life has a price attached to it or a reward to, attached to it um, and that life is about finding your purpose. So how do your products help you to feel good so that you can go out and find your purpose? Well, that's the, where the story began way, uh, 15 years ago. I ran into something called Oceans Alive, and what I noticed it did is it, it charged up my battery. Like I could just, I'd never had a feeling of a battery charge like that before, mm -hmm. where I could tap into energy. So that was my first learning curve. Then I found out that you can cleanse and nourish your body simultaneously so that anything you've had in your past, you can remove any damage it caused, and then you can rebuild your body to get a biological age of around 25 years old. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the activation products, you know, really have, it's really connected to you and something bigger, because I know that you were told that you only have a thousand days to live based on your health condition. So walk us through that experience and, you know, that aha moment. Yeah, that was a really interesting, we'll call it a trip, a journey, mm. because today I'm 63 years old and I've got about 20,000 days left to live based upon the trajectory and what we've learned. When I was 46 years old, I hit the wall with three different major health problems between heart disease, what was diagnosed as uh, colon cancer, which that's disputable, and liver cancer. So the liver cancer definitely did not happen. I had very bad diagnosis based on, you know, blood panels and enzyme numbers and all these different markers, but I would never allow biopsies. So in my opinion, I never had cancer ever but I did, I was very sick. And I remembered when I was 20 years old, 
that both my uncles on my mom's side died at 51 and 54 years old, both of cancer, two days apart, and they followed all the instructions that their doctors gave them at the time. That was in 1978. And there weren't a lot of uh, options then. You know, you just did what they told you. Mm-hmm. And it just, in 2004, I'm like, this is different now. We have, there's way more access to more natural ways and, and talking about root cause. And I didn't know what my, the root cause of my problems were. I just knew that the doctors, they actually didn't know. Mm-hmm. They were trying to treat it at the surface level and offering surgeries and drugs and all these terrible things that I didn't want. Uh, where normally, you know, hospitals save lives every day. But for me and my situation, it was very uncomfortable. So I decided to find, well, when I was told I had about a thousand days left, I thought, okay, that doesn't mean I'm dead in a thousand days. That means I have a thousand days left to live. Mm -hmm. Could I extend that to 5,000 if I learned what's going on? What are the root causes? What am I doing wrong? Well, it turned out that everything I was doing was wrong. And as I began fixing them, I did gain about a 5,000 day window based upon a trajectory that was uh, between 2004 and 2009. I was back in the medical range, so in a healthy state. Mm-hmm. And at that point, I'm, I was then 51. And then I realized, wow, you can actually use time to build even more time. So could I get 10,000 days if I use the 5,000 days wisely? And if I could get 10,000, could I make it 20? Well, the answer is yes. You do have to know the definitive, most important things to do to make sure you're not having a fire burning in the background you're not aware of. So all the fires have to be out and you've got to have cleansing and new nutri- like nutrients that cleanse and nourish simultaneously. And that's where activation went into an area that I didn't even know existed. Mm-hmm. And that's where we are today. And I know you touched base on the root cause. I know uh, doctors told you that it was a genetic disposition uh, that created this. And I'm sure there are a lot of people that when they go to the doctor, they're told this. So how can we heal our bodies from the inside, you know, with activation products? Yeah, and well, the genetic uh, disposition that, that you're presented with, I was presented with that several times and told, really, I can't do anything about it. It's just the, the you know, the cards you're dealt. <clears throat> then I learned about epigenetics. So epigenetics are where you can re-overwrite a script. It's not that you don't take things seriously. You just you look at it and you say, okay, if, if cancer is prevalent, heart disease is prevalent, I will take certain steps to overwrite that as much as I can. And then I found out that nutrients can do that because your body is a chemical factory. Everything you put into your body is like, whether it's food or supplements or fluids or whatever it may be, air, you are converting those things into energy which your body is always wanting to be healthy because we have an innate desire and a body intelligence to keep ourselves healthy and biologically young. Mm -hmm. So with that information, I was like, okay, what are the things out there at the very top level of each category for brain health, endocrine system, respiratory, circulatory, digestive, your connective tissue, your whole basic framework and what can we do to prevent things that may infect your body? Because I had these terrible infections of fungus and heavy metals, bacterial infections, and they were residing under the surface. So when your immune system goes down and you become compromised with too much toxicity, the alarms go off, but then you don't have the resources to be able to deal with it if you don't have the raw material. So when I'm talking about raw material, I'm talking about food, nutrients, <clears throat> micronutrients, nanonutrients, piconutrients, Dalton nutrients. These are uh, terms maybe people aren't that familiar with, but <clears throat> regardless, your body, your body's intelligence is so high that everything you put in it, it is just going to work with whatever you give it. If you give it low quality nutrients, it'll put up with it. It'll do the best it can. But then I found out when you introduce very high quality, undamaged in process nutrients that are actually trans factor. So people can learn about trans factor means that <clears throat> when you're bringing it in, is truly usable inside your cell. But if your cell membranes, which is on the exterior of all the cells in your body, are not optimally running, then you can't absorb properly and you can't eliminate properly. Therefore, you can't get the functionality of those foods you're eating to do the things that your body wants to do to keep all systems running well. Mm -hmm. And, and when you got this diagnosis, how long did it take you to actually start healing your body the natural way? 
And that was a little bit of a slow go, uh, mainly because I didn't know what I was doing. And I was trying to find people who really did. And when you go into the natural world, there's a thousand gurus mm. and everybody has a different opinion. Mm -hmm. So, but when I knew though, I knew that there were people on this earth who had the top level understanding for each thing. So it would be like good, great, greater, greatest. And if you can get to that greatest level, it's going to take the least amount of time, energy and money to get what you want. And what you want is a healthy body. Mm -hmm. You want a healthy mind, of course, a healthy emotional system and a healthy body in order to be at your top level functionality for yourself to be the most valuable to people on the earth. So finding those nutrients and just filtering out the things that were being promoted. So I was looking at a lot of things trending, but I noticed that many supplements were not of high quality. They were more selling because there's a trend and I had to wait and I had to wait until I met the right people who had done their lifetimes of research. So I, I became a researcher of the researchers instead of trying to do my own research and figure it all out, mm -hmm. I counted on people who had already received through knowledge and learning the information that was the most effective so that, you know, yourself, if you were going to do something, it's going to take the least amount of time, least amount of energy and the least amount of money now to accomplish your goals. So when I started, it was this, wow, I think it was around $1.5 million over the first four years. Wow. It had to be invested to learn what didn't work and then the few things that did work. Mm -hmm. and, and speaking about that, why did you want to bring these products to the forefront and the market? Well, the products really started speaking for themselves and I realized that it was it was more of a stewardship thing mm -hmm. that I was being given access to wonderful information because I could travel anywhere in the world I wanted, meet anyone I wanted, you know, and, and kind of go along to be led to the top level. So it's just like yourself, if you were, if you knew the best way to do something, there's something deeply inspired inside of you because you just want to share it because it gives us a great joy to see other people live a higher quality lifestyle and if we can share something with them. So it became a, a major sharing effort and it wasn't just the physical products. There was a major component of information products. Now information means protocol. What can you do for yourself for free? You know, you, you talk on, on some of your shows about meditation, the importance of that. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> clearing your mind it doesn't cost any money it costs mm -hmm. a little bit of time to do meditation mm -hmm. so the information side is how do you support your body from a <clears throat> mechanical physical dynamic standpoint so that the nutrients you're bringing in are simply complementary to who you are and what you're doing mm -hmm. and that's so that's where activation was born because activation was like I was seeing people activated to take more responsibility for their own health mm -hmm. I had to take full responsibility because I would have been taken out if I would have given it over to people who really didn't know me, they didn't know my background. And each person's so genuinely unique. It's like everyone's like a snowflake in a different design and pattern with a different genetic makeup, in a different history, in a different circumstance. So each person can, their body's so intelligent. It's just a matter of giving yourself the functional, foundational nutrients. Instead of trying to dive into some complex formula to deal with some disease that they say you have. My learning was that, oh, you could, if you reset your foundation you're standing on, many of the extenuating issues that are symptomatic, they just disappear over a period of time and you start to feel better every day because mm -hmm. you want to see progress all the time. And so if you're feeling better, that's a good indication. If you're feeling worse, you might be going through a detox, you might be going through a healing crisis, but you shouldn't be continuing feeling worse and nothing feels as good as feeling good. Mm -hmm. And when you feel good, you're happy and you've got a, you've got a, you're inspired, you're joyful, you're enthusiastic and you're getting more and more alive as you go day by day. Mm -hmm. And you know, they say that disease, it's from dis-ease in your body. So I think healing your body from the inside out is so important um, rather than, you know, a lot of doctors just give out pharmaceuticals. So I completely agree um, with your, your view on this. I, I wanna talk about the different categories. I have some of the products here. Um, you have Relax, Nourish, Thrive. So walk us through these different products and what they do. So on the Relax side, uh, you mentioned dis-ease. Well, we have a product called Ease. Okay. And it's really cool because you, you you just simply spray it on your skin. Now that's so we have beauty and health from the outside in and beauty and health from the inside out. So we cover both. Okay. The beautiful thing about ease is you can apply it anywhere in your body where you may have an ache or a pain. 
And a lot of aches and pains and stiffness are resulting from a low magnesium level. So the only thing in that product is magnesium chloride hexahydrate, but it's in a very special form. The way that we make it takes 11 to 12 hours. And then when it goes onto your skin, it goes directly into your body to be used cellularly. And you feel it right away. You can, you can improve your mood like within 90 seconds by just putting it in this area uh, during the day if you feel a little bit down for any reason. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's the, the relaxing. You know, you want to have relaxed energy. You don't want to be falling asleep. And you don't want to be having to, you know, stimulate your body with all, a bunch of stimulants like caffeine all the time. You want to have real deep energy. So the relaxing and the energy go hand in hand. Mm -hmm. And then on the nourish side, there's a whole line of these very cool seal, seed oils and seed oils are really not well understood. Uh, but we'll take a prime example. Uh, black, bl this black seed oil is very commonly known as, but black cumin, which is what it is, black cumin seeds pressed. And inside of those is a whole body tonic. Mm -hmm. So when you put it in your system, it's clearing the pathways. It's bringing in nutrients, is dealing with microbes and funguses and all the things that are interrupting your cellular function. You put it in your mouth and you chew it for one minute after breakfast in the morning, then get a warm glass of water and swallow it with the warm glass of water behind it and hits your hydrochloric acid in your stomach and turns into a very powerful uh, antibody builder for your immune system. And then from there, it goes to help with your joints, your liver, your heart, your kidneys, your brain. It does so many, your pancreas. It does so many functions. So when I learned about the seed oils, I wanted, I said, okay, but hold it. Oils go rancid. Uh, what, what's the processing like? And we were tapped into the highest tech in the world on how to produce seed oils without damaging. Neither the oil nor the seed itself is damaged. You can tell immediately because of the color, taste, texture, and then the lab report shelf stability compared to anything else in the market of its kind, it shines way above the crowd. And you as a, as a, person on the street using these things, right? The, the person right on the ground who's buying these can tell immediately the difference. So I really loved that. And I knew that we were then delivering it to the person in the original form that was inside the seed. And there's many different seeds for many different organ functions. Each one has a different nutritional profile. So this is like a delivery system when you put the seed oils in your body, whether it's amaranth or, or the black human or coriander or the, these different functional ones like the pumpkin seed oil for your reproductive system all of them your body intelligence knows <clears throat> but they get into the cell and every cell has a lipid membrane and those lipids are oils so it's like doing a complete body oil change where you have all the oils you have in your body are from packaged foods or from rancid oils or who who knows where they came from it doesn't matter when you put the good oils in your system your body knows exactly what to do as far as changing it out like letting it it's like a purging mm -hmm. and then on the thrive side oceans alive which i mentioned earlier is this uh, completely broad spectrum nanonutrient it has every nutritional molecule known to man in its original form this is heirloom this is originally a harvest from the ocean a 40-year study determined what were the strains best for human nutritional profile and is grown in a photobioreactor on land so it has zero contaminants from the ocean and it's very specific strain. So when you put that in your system, you get the whole orchestra of nutrients playing at once and your brain is like, okay, this is a good one. I love this. I can use that here, here, here. And so it goes in and you get this, this what I call a life battery charge that you can tap into. And that's, that's our primary product. That's the master product that started the company and has carried us to this day. That's amazing. And, you know, from talking to you, you can tell there's a lot of thought and science uh, behind each product. So, you know, talk to us about what can our viewers expect when trying out your brand? What, what separates your products from other products on the market out there? Well, they're going to notice right away that they're very unique and there's nothing else like them. Mm -hmm. But that their body, it, it, like all these little things that are symptomatic that are sort of underlying and bothering you, they just start to disappear and you notice it immediately. You don't have to wait around for this. And, and then you find out that there are certain things you'll use every day for the rest of your life, which we call must have. And then there's your like to have, want to have products and you have luxury products. Now you can use every one of them every day, but when you just put a little bit into your system, 
your affordability is is maximized because now you're not having to spend money on a lot of other things that you would otherwise need. And it doesn't mean we have the end all be all for everything. I'm not saying that. There are other things, you know, that we're adding in the K2 uh, D3 right now, which is we can't even get into that. It takes too long to talk about. But this is essential nutrient from a vitamin standpoint for your immune system, your cardiovascular, and your your bone structure. But <clears throat> what people notice, and we always get this feedback, and it's been over the years, that they they rant, they rave about these things that went away that we can't even publish because it would look like a medical claim. Mm -hmm. But what ha what happens is you're rebuilding your foundation. Your body has the material it needs to do the cleansing and nourishing and rebuilding and get you healthier than you ever even knew was possible. And it's all attributed to your own body having the, the raw material to work with and your intelligence because you're that unique person. And that's what we get feedback like that all the time. They, we can't make any medical claims though. Mm -hmm. And also I can tell that, you know, based on your experience and what happened to you being told you have a thousand days to live, um, I feel that you're more spiritual and more connected to, you know, the universe, the source. So talk to us about that. How, how did that experience happen for you? And, and um, did you become more spiritual? Yeah, and I would say the spirituality wasn't so much related upon the physical, even though your physical being can really limit you if you're very toxic and sick and you're down and depressed. But what happened is I knew that I could never find the people on my own who had the knowledge. It's like a needle in a haystack or even worse. Because you could have given me $10 trillion, you know, 15 years ago, I would have got all distracted with all the wrong things. I had, when you hit the wall, just like anybody hits the wall and you're in a desperate situation, you reach out and I prayed desperately because I knew I was in a world of trouble and I didn't know what to do. But I knew people who were in the earth knew, but how would I find them? So I knew I had to be led to them. Mm -hmm. So my prayer was if, if I could be led and shown who these people are and I will listen, I will do whatever it takes whatever I have to spend, time, energy, money, where, or even if I have to suffer, I'm willing and wide open whatever it takes. If I could just get myself back online and learn where I've made my mistakes, correct the errors, m make it so that I can be a better value on this earth to my family, to my colleagues, to the, my friends and to the world in general, that's the connection. So I was actually led through many different synchronicities, through pathways, that no way could it have happened. I saw the things in, in one day, four or five synchronicities happened that I knew I was in the right direction. And once I was on the path that I was supposed to be on, everything clicked together. And then I realized that there's a mission that we have. It's not my mission. I'm serving a mission. And the mission is to have as many people as healthy as possible on the earth, having the best possible lifestyle and becoming the best version of themselves to be the most valuable for those around them where we all learn that we're here to serve each other. We're all here to love each other. That's how we serve God, by loving and serving one another. And if we have the best possible gold for people, for their health and for their mental health, emotional health, because you know, your mental immunity, your spiritual immunity is super important. You, you have to know that you're set up so you're not just believing everything that people are telling you or just doing everything you're told, but you're, you're gaining knowledge and wisdom to be able to make intelligent decisions and have great outcomes. Mm -hmm. So the, the spiritual side is very big. You know, people are raised to believe different things in their life. You know, their parents teach them to believe the spiritual things, to believe in God or not, or whatever that is. And people grow up believing what their mom and dads believe. And it's, you know, socially, culturally important to do that, to have connection with your family. But at the same time, you've got to eventually stand in your own two feet and know that you know that you know that what you're tapped into is the right information and then you are, because you are a spirit being. You you don't have a soul. You are a soul, and you are responsible on this earth to make sure your state is at the highest level. Mm -hmm. You know you you can't control your genetics. You can't control the family you were born into. You you're it's a sovereignty thing there, but you are responsible for your state. So you're to believe that you are on this earth for a great purpose. We are do no harm. We are do as much good as we possibly can and have as much fun at it as possible. And just see people start to enjoy and get enthusiastic about being here, especially given the situation we have in the world now where they're, they've just systematically removed all the fun things away from everyone. Mm -hmm. And they're sort of sitting there waiting, going, how do I get that back? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. 
I love that, you know, you can tell this is really a passion for you. And when you talked about alignment, I think that happens um, when you when you find your calling and you find your passion. So I love that. And clearly some of the leaders that you've helped to uh, create these products really had a conscious reason why they created each, you know, each ingredient. And I want to talk about, you have some very unique ingredients in your products, uh, microalgae and nutrient dense oils. So talk to us about, you know, how these ingredients help to nourish the body. Well, because they're in a, in a fat soluble form and your body can digest those things and they carry all these nutrients. So if a person has liver problems and they want to cleanse the fatty liver, they would take the oils, which you would think would be counterproductive if it was fat. But, but just think of an oil as a, like, you know, if you took our oils and put it on a bottle that had glue on it from a label you peeled off mm -hmm. in 15 minutes, it'll be all soft and you can wipe it off. So we're, it's going in and it's getting the goo and the gunk and the, the grime of our life that we breathe rubber dust and break dust and fuel dust and all those things that we're breathing. We breathe 11,000 liters a day of air, breathe in and out. So that's a pretty major deal. So when you're supporting the organ function to stay clean, now it can be more effective. Your lungs have a better air capacity. Your pancreas has a better ability to balance your sugars out so you don't get into insulin problems. And all of the things that are in each element are again, going back to the functional foundational, uh, you know, like essential fatty acids, essential amino acids, uh, enzymes, all the things that your body makes vitamins and, and hormones from. Think about your hormonal system. I didn't even mention the perfect iodine product. Uh, that's just being rolled out in Canada now. We've had it in the States for a while. But iodine itself in its purest form is in every cell of your body. So where can people find out more information about your products and purchase them? Because we have a lot of international uh, viewers as well. Right. So the, our main website is activationproducts.com. But to see the actual place where you buy them, it's shop.activationproducts.com. And inside there is all the information about how each product works and, and the purpose behind it. And then all of the different special ways they can purchase the product. It's mostly online. And Ian, I always like to end the show on an inspirational note. Um, and you're obviously a very inspirational and enlightened person. So I want to ask you for our viewers that maybe are afraid to become entrepreneurs, they want to ditch the nine to five and take that leap to become an entrepreneur. What advice do you have for them? Well, yeah, the entre entrepreneurial ship is an interesting ship to be on. <laughs> and uh, entrepreneurs are often born because they have a special skill that they know the world will love and may be, they may be better than a lot of people. But what they don't know is that an entrepreneur has to understand every facet of business ultimately to be successful. Now there's a book called The E-Myth, which I think they should definitely read. And everyone could become an entrepreneur and a successful one. You know, it's not like, well, no, you're not, you're not wired for that. Come on, everybody can do what they set their mind to do if they really do want to learn and it's, it's principle based so there are principles that work together to form a foundation and and then knowing that they need they will require support they will require a business plan they, they've got to have some funding they've got to make sure they have a dashboard in their vehicle so to speak that works and and then they 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 know that they're that they have a plan like how big do they want to go what is their overall vision and that they are here to create value. It's not making money, it's creating value. Because the more value you create, the greater the money flow is. Mm -hmm. So if the desire is to make money, that's, the, that's like getting the cart in front of the horse. If your desire is to create exponential priceless value for people that they'll be more than happy to pay for, then the money flows automatically and you're in that e-flow. Mm -hmm. I, I think that's great advice. You know, if you're in it just to make money, you won't. But if you have products and you're of service to the world somehow and you're giving back in your own way, that's when you'll be successful. And I think that's why your company is so successful because, you know, you really have a meaning why you're doing this and you can tell this is really your passion and calling. So thank you, Ian, so much for being on the show today. It's been very insightful and we hope to have you back soon. Well, it's been a pleasure, Daryl. Thank you so much. Thank you. Tag TV is available on Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Apple and Android TVs, as well as on Apple and Android phones. Watch us live through YouTube and Facebook.